Hello viewers, welcome. In this video, we'll be showing you the T-Class X98 Plus. This is also labeled as the X Ultra Pad. Now, we purchased this tablet look, as we searched for one of the best high-res tablets available with lots of memory and storage. And this is what we found. This tablet has 64 gigs of storage, 4 gigs of memory, and has a really high res screen so this is let me go over the specs right over here on the side of the box let me see if i can get this in focus so the box says x98 plus with 64 gigabytes d windows 10 probably d means dual os the front is white the back is silver 64 gigs of storage and let's look over on the side and also look in the bottom. The bottom actually has the full specs over here. Tells you it's T Class X98 Plus 64 gig model processor Intel 64 bit Cherry Trail Z8300. Frequency is 1.84 gigahertz. This is a quad core tablet. Hard drive capacity is 64 gigs. Memory capacity 4 gigs of RAM. Touch screen 9.7 inch IPS screen. Look at that resolution. It's 2048 by 1536 and Windows 10 Android 5.1 camera 2 megapixel front 5 megapixel rear that's very good for a, uh, a tablet of this price range we got it for around 180 and on eBay and everything else is pretty much standard you, you know you have your TF card slot and your 3.5 millimeter uh, headphone jack and it has micro HDMI so let's open up the box and see what's included it's interesting to note that they've carefully added padding to the top lid of the box this probably would help protect the tablet and in addition we see the tablet they've placed the tablet face down to protect the screen during shipment and we can see the nice T-Class logo. It's a rotate. Let's actually remove the bag and see the tablet. Here it is. The tablet has a protective covering on the front. We can remove that and add a screen protector. In addition, the back also has a little plastic removable protector is probably difficult to see on the tablet let me see if I can get a, a good shot of the t-class logo at the top yes and the Intel logo Intel inside x98 plus it says t-class t pad and notice that the back side of the tablet is metallic now and if you feel it you know you, there's a plastic cover over it but it is truly a metallic surface the front was white the back it has a nice metallic finish and the bottom of the tablet has a two speakers so this is uh let me put this thing down for a moment and let's go over to see what else is included with the tablet here it looks like a manual very brief manual tablet computer series it doesn't give much uh, detail I guess it's just basic information if you want to know about the tablet I'll just put this down for now see what else is included let's remove this piece of cardboard and we see everything else that is included with the tablet here is the power adapter we notice that this is not a USA style power adapter we're gonna need uh, a substitute, uh, either an adapter uh, to connect to this, to convert it to the two-prong US style, or we're going to have to find an alternative. And here is T-Class, another, it seems like another T-Class manual. This is in, looks like Chinese and we can look at that in detail if we want uh, later on uh, let's see if there's any English at all no it's all in Chinese so we'll skip that for now here it looks like a T-Class warranty uh, registration or of some sort here's another manual and as we look at the manual it 
seems to list the specs. It says 5 to 5.2 volts, 2 to 3 amps. It must be referring to the AC adapter. We probably need to take a look at the AC adapter in a little more detail in a moment. Here is the probably the power cable. Uh, has uh, the, AC, the USB connection on one side and the micro USB on the other side. This is going to connect the AC adapter to the tablet. And here it looks like this is the on the go cable. One side has the micro USB and the other side is actually a female connector uh, for USB. So you can probably connect your USB drives or other USB devices to the tablet using this uh, cable that comes included, which is great. Now let's actually take a look in a little more detail in the at the power adapter. Given that this power adapter is not the right one we need in the U.S., and if I can get a good focus on it, I can see that over here it says the input is actually a uh, 2.5 amp max. So it says 5 volt, 2.5 amp max. So this is what we would need to find if we're shopping for an alternative AC adapter for our tablet. Now we've taken the tablet out and we've got our some fingerprints on the top surface of the tablet. But let's go over the buttons and f features of this tablet in a little more detail. Here we can see that there's a camera on the back side. This is the rear camera and it's on near the corner of the tablet and you can see the shiny surface and there's this T-Class logo it's it's a can't quite make it out but uh, again here's this uh, surface with the Intel inside logo X98 plus and this is a very clear shot of the T-Class T-Pad and it lists a, a number of different things it's designed by T-Class made in China and uh, it has two rear speakers, which is, should be really good for sound because now, even though separation is not too far apart, it is better than one speaker. And over here, we have the power button and the volume rockers. As I rotate over here, you can see that's the TF card slot, your micro uh, SD. Here's your uh, microphone this microphone input is here you can and over here we have the power this is where you're on the go or the power and then the headphone and your micro HDMI so this is nice there's a lot of nice little ports on the tablet and very convenient has a nice silvery finish and and there's a removable front screen protector and let's actually show you the camera on the front of the tablet and it's right over there let's power out the tablet and kind of give you a look at how it starts up and first thing we see is a t-class t-pad logo really nice and professional comes up with a boot screen and it's android on the left windows on the right and there's a timer. It says four seconds. I the moment I tap, and I tap OK, it starts to come up. I it should come up in Android mode, given that I tapped Android icon. It may take a few seconds to come up. See the Intel inside. A little nice animation. I don't hear anything, but that's totally fine. Uh, the animation does not have any sound. It's just a visual animation and there it is it's android experience let me just swipe up 5.1 and show you that uh, this is the android 5.1 let me tap the button here we see that it's actually a very plain android uh, install you rotate it and you can see that it actually has very few apps installed. It does have the Play Store. And the Play Store is very important because that lets you download all the apps that you need. 
And again, this is the Play Store. It's really good to have. Ha it comes with settings. So let's take a look at the settings. See if we can uh, get into some additional information about the tablet. Probably about tablets, what we're looking for. And it says Android 5.1 for the version. Kernel 3.14.3. .3, X98 Plus. I think the model is AC a5c8 and that's pretty much it let me hit hardware information and see if it has any inf other information uh, we believe all the hardware is correct on this um, it's four cores intel atom x5 z8300 1.44 gigahertz four gigs of ram and it's allocated 20 gigs of storage for rom and so the rest probably went to Windows. And that is pretty much the great specs that we were expecting. And let's see, storage, it tells you that uh, internal storage is partition of four gigs internal and ROM is 20 gigs. And it's roughly 19 to 20 gigs free. And of course you can still add a micro SD or a TF card and add additional space looks really nice so far you know the specs uh, are accurate and let's actually next see if there's anything else to look over here if not we we'll probably what we want to do is hop into the menu and see if we can take this and reboot and holding down the power button it comes up the screen to boot to windows let's actually do that and reboot the tablet into windows It'll probably take uh, a few seconds to come up again and it is now rebooting we expect it to go straight into windows and uh, since it's the first time we might have to wait and if so we'll skip through that step and it is booting straight in windows it's not going to prompt us for the windows or android boot step and i think for the first time it's going to ask us to wait so let's just skip over that right now here we are so we have windows 10.1 fully booted up and you can see it has a very nice background and notice that uh, there's a green icon on the left that's to boot back into Android mode and let me lay this thing down the screen is really very nice there's actually no flickering of any kind unlike unlike what you might see on the screen it, that it's a camera artifact and let me show you the specs here is 20.4 gigs free of 32.6 so a large portion of the uh, storage is still available you know given that we have roughly 20 gigs free on windows and 20 gigs free in android mode this is very good partitioning and here's your w typical windows 10 experience here they have uh, a number of things installed Microsoft Edge and your uh, prior trial office your opportunity to get trial Microsoft's trial office package you see the get office uh, button over there and so this is your Windows 10 experience probably nothing very special but the fact that this is a tablet that you can boot into both Windows and Android makes it really special so there you have it, the T-Class X98 Plus. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If so, please tap the thumbs up. We'll be having more great videos to come. Please subscribe so you don't miss out. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.